Hi everyone, in today's video we are going to be discussing how to find the volume of a prism. The formula to find the volume of a prism is equal to capital B times H. Capital B is the base area and H is the height. So we have two different types of prisms. We have a triangular prism and a rectangular prism. To find the area of the base of a triangular prism, the area of a triangle, remember, is one-half base times height. The area of a rectangular prism is length times width. We must remember those individual area formulas because they will be used inside the volume of a prism formula. Here we have the volume V of a prism is the product of the area of the base and the height of the prism. So here we have area of the base, capital B, and the height for both a rectangular prism and a triangular prism. The volume V is equal to capital B, which is the area of the base, times the height of the prism. Let's take a look at the first example. Find the volume of each prism. So number one, we have a rectangular prism, 3 meters by 18 meters by 12 meters. So remember, the formula is V is equal to capital B times H. Remember, though, that that capital B represents the base area, and because we have a rectangle, we need to find the area of the base, which is length times width. So really, this becomes the volume is equal to length times width times height. So 3 times 18 times 12 is 648 meters cubed. Remember, we always cube for volume. In the next question, we have a triangular prism, which means the base of this prism is a triangle. So, the volume formula is V is equal to capital B times H. That capital B represents the base area, which of a triangle is one-half base times height. So, one-half times four times three times the height, which is two, put that in your calculator, and you end up getting V is equal to 12 inches cubed. Next, let's look at a region's question. A shipping container is in the shape of a right rectangular prism with a length of 12 feet, a width of 8.5 feet, and a height of 4 feet. The container is completely filled with contents that weigh, on average, 0.25 pound per cubic foot. What is the weight in pounds of the contents in the container? So the first thing I notice in this question is we have a rectangular prism. And so, in order to find that, we need to find the volume of it. So, my formula is V is equal to capital B times H, but because it's a rectangle, it's really length times width times height. So, I multiply 12 times 8.5 times 4, and I get 408 feet. But remember, the container is completely filled with contents that weigh, on average, 0.25 pound per cubic foot. So in order to find the weight, I have to multiply the 408 feet cubed by 0.25, and that gives me 102. And that's the weight in pounds of the contents in the container. So all we had to do was multiply our volume by 0.25 to get 102, which is answer choice 3. 